Welcome and a big yee to you all. So today we're going to have a look at one of my favourite pistols uh, that's available at the moment. Uh, it's the Colt Peacemaker, um, made by Umarex. It's a brilliant, brilliant gun. Loads and loads of fun to use. Single action, um, shell loading, uh, really, really good fun. Um, lovely, lovely to look at and it just gets you in the mood. Um, you know, when you're down the range, unleash that inner, inner child, cowboys and Indians, loads and loads of fun. So let's move on to taking a look. We've got three different types here. We've got the blued, uh, we've got the antique and we've got the nickel. So today we're going to be looking at my favorite out of them, which is the antique. So opening up the box straight out there. Here we go, just taking a look. And there we have it. Colt Peacemaker. Beautiful, beautiful gun. Lovely to look at. Um, really, really good fun. Good weight to it. It's a little bit light on the rear end, but obviously there's nothing <laughs> nothing really going on down here. Um, grips feel okay. Um, a little bit plasticky, but not. You know, obviously they're not real wood, um, but yeah, it's got a good, good overall feel to it. Um, safety, just in front of the trigger down here, um, so back obviously being safe and flicking that forward. Okay, let's flick it into the fire position, and now we can cock the pistol if we wish. Okay, and decock it. This has got a feature that enables you to half cock it. So you half cock that, and that enables you to rotate the, the barrel, the cylinder here. Okay, so you can rotate that cylinder all the way around, and that's how you get into loading your shells. So shell loading, flip that to the side. Okay, as you can see there, and you can flip it into the right position. Um, you have got, just down here in front, um, a, it's like a shell ejector. So flip that into the right place and pull it up, and it's going to eject your shell as you go on so it's just finding that right place and then getting it to go up you could always just flick it out if you're a badass okay um, so depending on how you want to do that um, either way is fine um, just one is a lot easier and a lot lot cooler pellet wise we're going to be using some econic sights um, just to find Pistol, we're not going for anything too accurate, or, or um, you know, we're, we're, we're not going to put some R10 match or anything through it. We're just going to use some cheap and cheerful econ sights. So, to load that in, all we're going to do is get the flat end of our pellet and it's going to go in in the rear like that. Let's just push it in, and we'll carry on doing that to load them all up to get it ready. CO2 with these, okay, so we're just going to put that back there. So, CO2 with these, like most air pistols is stored in the handle so you can be able to see there is a, a allen key bit there there's also a small little ridge to enable you to get your finger in just pop that side off and that's going to allow you to, to access your co2 holder these quite handily come with a little allen key attachment there already so you can just stick that in the back um, and then wind wind down your allen key co2 goes in like so and then we're just going to screw this up. So just screw that up till it's got a good seal. Okay. And then pop that side back on. Just a, a single point front sight there. The rear sight is just a groove down the back there. Um, I mean, these are, these are going for fun. It is by no mean a target pistol. Um, it takes a little bit of getting used to, but you can actually do quite well with these. So it's lots and lots of fun. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to load up the rest of these shells. We're going to take them in the range and put some shots down the range. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're in the range now. So we're going to load up, half cocking it, allowing us to rotate that cylinder. Just popping our rounds in. Like so. Uh, 
there we go. And now we're ready. Okay, so here we go with six shots at five meters. There we go, quite fun. Um, five meters, I guess, is the sort of desired target distance, but we'll send it all the way down to 10 and see how we do. <laughs> there we go. So, group's a little bit bigger. All six on paper though, 10 metres. Lots of fun. It felt really good shooting that. Um, really enjoyed that, really happy. So, there we go. We've got our, uh, our targets. Um, 10 metres. Okay, so, we've still got all six shots on the paper, albeit a little bit all over the place, um, but that's obviously down to me, and also the, the pistol um, being being more of a, a bit of a fun gun. Um, and then five metres, a lot, a lot better. Um, all six shots on there. Uh, great, great fun, this pistol. Absolutely love it. Um, not a massive fan of the grips, if I'm honest, um, it's probably the only thing that really lets it down. Um, yeah, I mean, the handiness of this key actually works really well. Um, most others don't. Um, safety, uh, I guess they've got to shoehorn it in somewhere. It's a little bit stiff. Uh, obviously, this is a brand new pistol. Um, but yeah. Uh, eases up with use but still a little, little bit stiff to start off with um, yeah grips grips a bit small for my big hands okay so um, but other than that it's great great fun it's got a good weight to it looks beautiful um, and yeah just most importantly makes shooting it fun it feels really really good to shoot it's loads of fun it brings that like i said at the start it brings that kid out in you that you know cowboys and indians you, you just feel you feel 110 percent more manly more more like a cowboy um when you when you're shooting this it's so so much fun um you know that only comes from like it, like a, a western style whether it's like this or an underlever that sort of thing you get a real real kick out of it um and yeah pellets just just econic sights nice and nice and cheap and usable so yeah great great fun um worth picking up now uh, these along with pretty much all the other the things that are coming out of Umarex, um this way, be it the CP88s and stuff like that, are just going up and up in price, um, and I can't see that slowing down anytime soon. So it's worth 
worth grabbing one while you can. Um, this is the pellet version. Um, so, yeah, I would, uh, would highly recommend it. Uh, fantastic pistol.